equation. Okay, what you will do is go to menu, go to equation, go down to equation, press enter, ex enter. Now there will be three options f1 simultaneous, f2 polynomial. So whenever you have a quadratic or a cubic equation, it's your polynomial. So press f2, the polynomial is exactly in the f2, f2. Degree, degree is the highest power, which is square. So you, you have to just type in the coefficient. One thing is very important when you use this, your quadratic equation should be in this form, in the standard form. So you need to get all the terms on one side, make the other side equal to zero. Okay, so you have the coefficient of x squared, which is 20. Over here, there's a coefficient of x squared, which is 20. Then minus 7, that's a coefficient of x, that's minus 7. You can use any minus sign, you can use this minus or this minus sign, it won't matter. Minus 3, press enter, press enter again twice. So when you look at here, you get a decimal equivalent, here you get a fractional equivalent. So my roots are this and this. You can write either decimal or fraction. fraction. You can write either decimal or fraction. 